The National Drug Law Enforcement Agency, NDLEA, says it has no request to buy sniffer dogs in its 2023 budget proposal, as insinuated in some reports, adding that its position on the cost of specialized dogs was in response to a question by the chairman, House of Representatives Committee on Drugs and Narcotics, Honorable Francis Ota Abu, on the need for sniffer dogs at the Inamdi Azikiwe International Airport, Abuja. The Anti-Narcotics Agency in a statement on Saturday said its chairman, Chief Executive Officer, Brigadier General Mohamed Buba Marwa, had on Thursday, 3rd November, while defending its 2023 budget before the House of Representatives Committee on Drugs and Narcotics, explained in response to Honorable Abu's comment that the total package of getting a specialized dog, including its training cost and average of $15,000 to $20,000. These are dogs that are able to detect up to 70 different types of drugs and substances. This is indeed an open source information that can be verified by anyone interested in knowing the fact about this kind of dogs. Indeed, the full package of some specialized dogs, especially those used for specialized protection, detection, and law enforcement in other jurisdictions, costs as much as $30,000 to $50,000, even $80,000 and more, depending on the type of skills and duties such would be trained to perform. In fact, Harrison K9 and Aiken South Carolina, Carolina US-based company sells for as much as $230,000. It's on record that General Marwa, however, stated in his response to Honorable Abu's comment that in addition to the fact that the agency has and uses sniffer dogs provided by the German government, it has acquired new scanners for use at the nation's airports. All of these have been largely responsible for the daily arrests and seizures made by officers and men of the agency.